Hello YouTube, uh, just want to show you my little solar tracker I made, uh, just for grins. Apologize for the iPhone video, but uh, just wanted to share this. It's nice uh, sunny April here in the Pacific Northwest. Uh, I've got a Renji 160 watt uh, flex panel that I've had for a few years. Uh, I keep moving around to get <clears throat> better efficiency, so I, um, during the pandemic had some time, um, <clears throat> put together a uh, little tracker so here I'll show you how this works so there's a it's made out of half inch and one inch PVC and there's basically two main components there's the frame that uh, the panel sits on and you can see where the, the half inch goes into the one inch um, is just loose so that's kind of my pivot point there um, <clears throat> and we go around to the back side and <clears throat> at the top another uh, type of um, you know small into big here so that's just uh, part of the pivot and the advantage of this is you can just pick this whole uh, panel and uh, frame up and uh, uh, take it off and uh, put it away because that's one of the uh, my goals was to make it uh, portable um, so we can fit it in the, uh, the motor home when we go camping um, <clears throat> so then uh, to make it turn I've got these two uh, solar panels up here. Uh, they are, I believe they're 10 watt a piece and um, they're wired together um, negative and positive, positive and negative. So whichever side has more sunlight, that's the polarity of the uh, power that goes down to my handy dandy little um, <coughs> gear motor. This is 12 volt, uh, 10 RPM. And what I'm using here is the GT2 belt. Um, so it's got, uh, it's a cogged belt, uh, very commonly used in 3D printers. Um, so I've got a 16 tooth um, drive um, pulley up top and then two idler pulleys down here. And then I just uh, just use a little clip to clip it off to uh, the, <coughs> the frame here. And as the sun uh, goes through the sky, the uh, solar panels uh, build up enough power to drive the motor and if it goes one way and then if the sun flips to the other panel it goes back the other way so it'll go from east to west uh, during the day and then in the morning um, <clears throat> when the sun comes up it'll uh, rotate back and uh, off you go so that's uh, pretty much what I've got there pretty simple I've got um, I think the PVC was most expensive probably $30 worth of PVC and little fittings and um, the other stuff I've got about 20 bucks in it so uh, yeah so about um, 50 bucks for the whole thing um, I get uh, I don't know maybe 10 to 15 percent improvement on my solar output by tracking the Sun versus just letting it sit there and I will say this is just a obviously a single panel or a single axis um, tracker um, I didn't attempt to do the other axis because uh, you can just, you know, adjust the feed if you want to prop them up to match uh, the time of the year um, to get the correct uh, second axis. So, anyway, YouTube, hope you like it. If you like it, uh, ask, ask me some questions. Um, subscribe, like, and share. Thanks. Bye.